To say Barb Schickler likes her electric car is a bit of an understatement. Yes! <laughs> She's one of nearly 67,000 electric car owners in Washington, according to the Department of Energy. I am now connected. Ta-da! <laughs> Charging has been free at various outlets for years, but the city of Bellingham is now making people pay. Drivers will now pay 25 cents per kilowatt hour. That's about $2 for a full tank of electricity for your average electric car, plus 75 cents an hour to park. For high-speed charging stations, it's an additional $1 per hour. According to the city of Bellingham, a driver at a standard charging spot would spend $3.60 for two hours, gaining 42 miles of range. The cost for gasoline would be about double that. Some argue that the city forcing people to pay to plug when they can do it for free elsewhere might keep EV owners from coming downtown. There we go. Then we walk away. That's the extent of it. But the Snyders, traveling from Bainbridge to Blaine for the New Year's holiday, specifically stopped in Bellingham to recharge. Of course we're going to come here and spend a couple hours and shop, have lunch, uh, maybe go to the Spark Museum. Yeah, enjoy Bellingham. The city is currently building 45 charging stations, a total of 90 plug-ins, funded by a state grant and a sales tax increase approved by Bellingham voters for green transportation. <laughs> okay. Barb would like to see even more. The infrastructure needs to catch up. That is the problem. We need more electric charging stations. And city officials hope to do just that sometime in the not-too-distant future. For now, the 45 new charging stations will open in the springtime. In Bellingham, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.